Hi Cancers, welcome to NT Tarot. Today we're going to do your love reading for April 2024. I call in all my guys, angels, ascendant masters. Please help me be a clear channel for the Cancerian Collective who will be tuning in and watching. So in the pre-shuffle, uh, before I turn on the camera, I had the Twin Flame card that came out. I put it back in the deck. I shuffle some more. This literally jumped out. Together, find joy in the simple pleasure of just being together. And then the bottom of the deck, it has proposal and offer or proposal in the near future that comes as a surprise. So for some of you, it's a twin flame connection, the connection that you're watching the video for. And you will be together or will be coming together soon if you're not together yet and there is an offer or a proposal in the near future that comes as a surprise to you all right so i just wanted to share that with you guys because they were so positive wow i put it back and this is just what dropped out window a new adventure in love is coming get ready Closure, not all connections are meant to be. Accept closure, adventure, seek adventure together. It adds excitement to your journey. So this, uh, I'm just going to take that to the top card because I feel it resonate with all the other cards that's been jumping out. A new adventure in love. So um, I'm sensing there may be a reconnection or a new love for some that may be coming in for others it may be you know a reconnection of a past love twin flame and past love could mean past life or someone you do already know and have met in this life nurture just jumped out nurture your relationship like blooming flowers though flourish all right so let's see current energies for Cancer and Collective. Ah, these cards are slippery. They're new. All right. So reflection or imperfection is what just jumped out. Uh, love is a beautiful mess. Embrace its interpretations. So accept yourself as you are. Or that may be uh, them learning to accept themselves as they are. What does Cancer need to know? Messages for the Cancerian Collective tuning in. Current energies for Cancer for April. I felt like this didn't flip over, but energetically I felt like uh, I wanted to flip that over and I did. And that's what comes up. Dressing up. An opportunity to dress up and party. Fun times ahead. So it sounds like you guys are going to be. And look you guys. Bottom of the deck again. That's what we started out with. Together. Find joy in the simple pleasures of just being together. So. And look. It's the same series. And you guys saw me shuffle. So a proposal. Dreams. Look to your dreams. They hold all the answers you seek and then doorway and opportunities about to present itself that leads you to a new person. Wow. Interesting. Very interesting. And this is not only in message in your dream, but I'm also getting, you know, your dreams may come true. So you guys are going to be getting together. There's going to be a surprise proposal or offer, dressing up, getting invited to go to an event, a party, a wedding, a birthday, some kind of event, an opportunity is about to present itself. That leads you to a new person. So still, still similar messages that I'm getting. I'm going to put these up here since these are current energies. I know you guys can't see it's out of the shot, but I want to make room for the tarot cards. For some of you, you guys are going to be reconnecting with your soulmate twin flame. And then for others, you guys may be meeting someone new. Okay, new opportunity coming in. Because bottom of the deck, I have friendship. 
this connection is based on friendship it may never develop in into romance and then we have that door closure so for some of you you may be just realizing that the connection or the person you've been waiting for is just friendship and you guys may move on and have a new love coming in and then for others there is a twin flame connection and you guys may reunite or getting together so there's two um, energies here some of you are closing a connection that's just a friendship or karmic connection that you may have thought was your twin flame connection and then your twin flame is coming in new love opportunity and for others it is a t twin flame connection and you guys will be getting together and in, e either, in either case you guys are going to be there's a love coming in a new love whether new as in brand new or new as in the person is coming back to reconnect and the and your dreams that will fulfill your dreams your dreams your heart desire they're gonna make a proposal an offer an emotional offer some kind you guys are gonna be together you guys are gonna be going somewhere together and it's gonna be based on love and friendship as well so this also means not what this card is saying but just a, a connection based on friendship as well as love and then see for some there is a closure now this could since it's a general reading it could be them too going through a close a closure not all connections are meant to be except closure so they could be you know closing doing a closure so that they can move on to you so take it how it resonates any other messages for cancerian this one you want it to jump Charisma, love flows to you. You radiate charisma and charm. Yeah, so no matter what, there is a love that's coming in for you guys. So opportunity and love. Bottom of the deck, we have destiny. The reunion with your twin flame is a destiny event. And remember I said at the in the pre-shuffle, I also had twin flame. It didn't come out again this time, but destiny came out. And I think this came out in the pre-shuffle as well. So that's why I said some of you, I feel it's a reunion, reconnection. For some of you, it's a new connection. So there's two groups of Cancerian here that may be watching. The reunion with your twin flame is a destined event. It's destined. And look, underneath we have passion. Keep the flame of passion alive. It's the heartbeat of love. All right. So we have all these cards here so I can reference it. Oh, long distance. Love knows no distance. It transcends time and space. So for some of you, you guys, it may be a long distance connection or they may be living a long distance away from you across the world in a different state, different country, different city. So, but there is or there will be a reconnection. All right. All right. So let's do tarot cards. Tarot cards. Guys, angels, Senate masters. What does Cancer need to know in regards to their love connection? Messages for the Cancer. Okay, temperance, balancing. We've had this before maybe even last month it came out several several times they're balancing balancing healing balancing all right so balance ah bottom of the deck heartbreak remember in the past readings we kept seeing this heartbreak this heartbreak they've been really hurt by an ex by a past karmic relationship that's the closure that they're with that doorway they're doing the closure on so they're healing and balancing still healing balancing from that and their angel since this is an angel their angel may be helping them or their guys their higher self so but i'm hearing but they're ready to move on yeah they're being strong 
So finding that inner strength to move forward, to be strong. Yeah, because I, I keep hearing, I heard that again. Their past, their ex did a number on them. So it was not a good ending. I think they may have used them, abused them. And look at this, death. Transformation, yeah, ending. Nine of swords, stress. That's that energy again, we keep seeing that. And the devil, oh my god. Goddess, goddess of Cups, this is you, Queen of Cups. So this is the energy they're closing, the closure on. This negative energy that, that we have, that doorway that's closing. This doorway right here. An opportunity is about to present itself that leads you to a new person. Oh, we had closure too. It was a closure one. I think I put the closure back. But yeah, there is closure as well. So they're closing, but that person, their past, their ex, their karmic, that person did a number on them. They're still trying to heal from it. And they are healing. It took a lot of strength for them. That's why we have that temperance. Here's you, you show up. We'll put you down here. And you could, so for some of you, you could be healing for them since this is underneath the temperance. I just happen to put it there. Nine of Cup, yeah, wish fulfillment. You are their wish fulfillment in love. We have Son of Wands. So this is Knight of Wands, passionate, moving forward, forward movement. Yeah, see how the energy shifted from that to this. This is you, their wish fulfillment. Lots of passion for movement, moving forward. Yeah, new beginning, clarity, ace of swords, new message coming in, clarity, truth, justice. We have air energy here as well. So this is page of swords. So they could be checking on you, looking at you, checking you out, keeping an eye on you, curious about you, because this came out a lot in the past. And here you are, the empress, yep. And Knight of Swords, for movement. Onward, upward, look at this. Onward, upward, for movement. Ten of Cups, emotional fulfillment. See, the energy is totally shift down here. This is all new energy. That's all old energy. That's past. Daughter of Cups, this is you, Page of Cups. So this is the surprise. The surprise uh, offer that came up. So this goes with the, did I put it back? No, it goes with the Oracle cards right here. An offer or proposal in the near future that comes as a surprise. This is it right here. See, she's surprised. So the tarot card is validating the uh, oracle cards. So that's why I have my oracle cards here so I can reference back. Yep. A proposal coming in. It brings emotional happiness and it may, may be a surprise to you. Celebration, friendship, celebration, because we had friendship as well. Top of the deck, Eight of Cups, walking away, walking away from that no longer serves them and moving forward. Yeah, they were on the defense. Four of Swords, healing, healing from that heartbreak. And then moving forward. Yeah, two movement cards. Walking away, Eight of Cups and Six of Swords. Moving away to a better place. Leaving all that darkness behind. Moving forward. And look, tower. They had a tower moment. And there's fire energy here. 
King of Wands. They could have had a tower moment with a fire sign, a Sagittarius, a Leo, um, or an Aries. Look, Ten of Pentacles, happy, happy ever after. Solid foundation moving forward. And they were trapped in the past with their thought. This this is all this energy here. Yeah, there there was heavy burden. Justice. Karmic justice. The scale of balance. Goddess of Pentacles. So uh Queen. A pentacle. So this is karmic. There's earth energy as well. There's fire energy and there's earth energy that could have been the karmic that they're dealing with. But there's justice. The scale of balance and let wish fulfillment the star. Balancing. They're balancing and healing. Healing and balancing and let two of cups coming together. See, we have this energy here. We have the Nine of Cups, and then we have this Temperance and Healing. We have the Star, so this Healing Energy. So basically, they need to heal before the connection can begin. Otherwise, they'll be bringing in the Toxic Energy, and you don't want that. Yeah, Defeat. Self-Sabotage. Here's your energy. Chariot, four of movement, three of pentacles working together, the emperor, here he is, the emperor, we had the empress here, all right, let's pull from another deck, final outcome, any additional messages or final outcome for the cancer collective who will be tuning in and watching. What does Cancer need to know? What does Cancer need to know in regards to their love connection, love interest? This card right here. Ace of Wands. Wow, fire sign. We have the fire sign twice right here. Oh, this is a uh, King of Wands. Oh, this is Ace of Wands. My bad. This is Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands is new beginning. This deck, they have a person for the Ace that confused me. I thought it was the uh, Queen of Wands, but it's actually the Ace of Wands. So new, passionate, new beginning. Okay. Passionate, new beginning, wish fulfillment, connection. So with passion. Oh, my God. All oh, the whole deck fell. Well, the deck is new and it is slippery, but there's no accidents. So I has said new beginning with passion. That's a lot of passion. Lots of passion and emotion. Moving away to a better place. Look, we have the lovers. Working on the connection, getting together, moving to, to a better place. I'm just curious. This is way too many cards, but I wish, oh, Nine of Cups, Wish Fulfillment. Twin Flame card fell out. There's this clump here. I'll put it back. But I was just curious. All right. So. What else does Cancer need to know? When I said, what else does Cancer need to know? I was trying to fix the car that fell down. This spirit drew my attention to that together. So there's going to be a together. You guys are going to be together. Okay, so I'm going to put it there. So it's right in the center of the spirit. And there's passion. Ace of Wands and this connection. Wish fulfillment. This is, this is the connection you've been waiting for. Fix my cars. 
What else does Cancer need to know, Spirit? This card right here. King of Cups. That's the love offer together. Yep, proposal, love offer, Man magician manifesting, manifesting your heart's desire. Cars are jumpy. The hermit, Virgo energy. There's your Virgo. So we have these cards for out the devil, six of cups, and two of swords. So they may have been conflicted in the past, indecisive at a crossroad, and there was some toxic energy, negative karmic energy, but there is a reconnection, a reconnection, a reuniting, getting together. And that's what Spirit wanted to stress. You guys will get together will be together they are coming with an offer proposal we started out with that proposal right here proposal right here proposal proposal possibly with an uh, uh, Virgo ship have come in all right final outcome for this connection with cancer spirit I hear happiness because we got wish fulfillment twice, right? We got nine of cups and we have the star. And look, temperance. Healing, balancing. So this is the clarifier deck and the same cards coming out. Healing, balancing. So final outcome is a very balanced, loving connection, full of love, passion, romance, your heart's desire, your wish come true. The star, the nine of cups, um, twin flame connection, also very balanced, very healing, very loving, emotional, um, emotional fulfillment with this ten of cups as well. Two of wands, they're planning. So expect a surprise offer. There's an offer coming in to, oh yeah, there's an offer coming in. Proposal, 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 surprise offer. So it's, it, it, it will take you by surprise. It's unexpected, unexpected. Six of wands, victory, victorious. The moon, yeah, you don't see it coming, but this is your your energy as well. The moon, Cancer is ruled by the moon. And look, as I say, this is your energy. We have Queen of Cups, Victory, the Moon, Queen of Cups. There is fire energy, but I think that's the past. But moving forward, they're moving away from that, and this is in you're in their future. So their the, their back is to her. her Closure, closing, healing, that's the past. Facing this way towards you and the Queen of Cups. So expect a together proposal, happy times, heart's desire, wish fulfillment coming in for you. All right, Cancerian, I will leave that there. I hope that was helpful and useful to you. I hope it resonated. Let me know in the comments if it did. Wishing you all the best, loving light to you, and I will catch you again on the next video. Bye, Cancers.